The stepping motor has a 0.72 degree step angle to rotate with one pulse. Because of this, when operated at a low speed, it repeats moving and stopping. This sometimes causes vibration. One of the major causes of the vibrations is the one-step response characteristic. In this graph, the horizontal axis represents the time, and the vertical axis represents the angle. This shows how the stepping motor makes a one-step rotation. It does not completely stop after rotating 0.72 degrees with a one-step movement. It repeats damping by going forward a little past 0.72 degrees, and then coming backward a little, and coming back a little further before a complete stop. The portion going forward past 0.72 degrees is called an overshooting, and the one coming backward past it is called an undershooting. These overshootings and undershootings are the causes of the vibrations in the stepping motor. When the stepping motor is continuously operated, the one-step response characteristics are continuous too. In this graph, they are represented as continuous step response characteristics. When operated at a low speed, the motor repeats overshootings and undershootings before it stops and then moves one step forward. When it is operated at a little higher speed, the overshooting timing and the motor's forward movements are overlapped, making the vibrations more violent. The frequency at this time is called a resonant frequency. When it is operated at a much higher speed, the motor proceeds to the next movement before the overshooting and the undershooting occur, and so the vibrations are reduced and the operation becomes smoother.